I had a really awesome idea. I thought I would do a video paying someone on Fiverr to create a print-on-demand t-shirt for me everything i don't want to have to do anything and the reason i'm making this video is because so many people struggle with print on demand print on demand t-shirt design i know a lot of people struggle with the marketing aspect of it as well and that will be coming too but i thought you've got to start somewhere and there are so many people on fiverr who create the most incredible designs and is it actually worth it so we're going to go onto fiverr right now we're going to have a look and we are going to actually pay someone, right? I don't know why I'm paying people because I don't need it, but we're going to be paying someone to come up with some designs and I'm going to critique those designs and see, was it worth it? How much did it cost? Is it is it something that you should do? Because if you think about it, a lot of people say one in 10 designs become successful. And if you're paying someone 10 pounds or $10 for a design, you're paying for 10 designs to get a successful one. That's going to be $100. Is that worth it? And we're going to find out right now. No more faff except for one last bit of faff. If you haven't already smashed the like button, let's get this video to like 100 likes. Come on, I know we can do it. And... If you haven't already subscribed, I think like thirty percent of um, sorry seventy percent of my viewers watching the videos aren't subscribed. And I'm not sure why. So if you haven't already subscribed, help me get to ten thousand subscribers. It's going to mean so much. And to be honest, I'm just so gutted that you don't get a plaque for ten thousand subscribers. I know. Look, once I get to 10,000, I'll be asking you to help me get to 100,000 because then I can get my YouTube plaque. But anyways, let's just get straight into the video. So first, we're going to go to Fiverr. And whilst on Fiverr, I'm literally just going to do a very basic search, print on, and you can see I've done it before. I have planned this video. We're going to do a very basic print on demand search. And let's have a look. So we've got all different prices and what's like on offer really. So I will create a design for any niche, any product, print on demand shirt. Okay, that's potential about 1697. We're seeing if we can get this for little money. I will send a high quality vector SVG t-shirt designs, print on demand. I feel like he's just not going to create them he's just going to have a big catalog of them and then just send them to you i don't like that okay i will design unique t-shirt okay let's do this one eight pound 49 that's 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 decent all right we can we can do that. let's read okay so firstly he's got 1462 reviews only one order in queue which means he probably won't take very long to actually give you your design so i know it says two days here um yeah it says two days here you can see but because he's only got one order in queue it's a little trick on fiverr you can see it probably won't take that long having a look at his designs they look pretty pretty good i mean i, I wouldn't do that because it's probably copyright but whatever but um they look like very cool design so he says i will design high selling customized original print ready professional t-shirt designs do you want to run a campaign on teespring teasley spreadshirt or if you are a amazon merch if you're if you're an amazon merch nice i didn't i didn't know you could be an amazon merch or have any other project for custom t-shirt business or okay i understand his english is probably not going to be the best because they are not from england all right that's fair I don't want to comment on anyone's english my english is pretty shocking at times um so in this in five dollars you will get a professional and high quality work okay um vector png files it's so ironic that the word professional spelled wrong but again like i said I, i'm it's just funny my english is also shockingly bad so you know what i i don't have a leg to stand on here vector png files so that's exactly what you need because that's what you need to go on t-shirt so that's yeah transparent background thank you high printable quality yep so because the t-shirt's going to be printed um fast respond time yep revision yep ai file if needed that's pretty cool um but don't need it 100 percent satisfaction guaranteed always deliver to order this gig you have to provide text or design th designing theme and i don't know what that means because I, if i give him the text I didn't want to do anything, remember. So I'm going to I'm gonna message him and see what that means. Color of the shirt. Okay, I'll just say black. How many colors can I use in design? I'm going to say three. An output format you want. Uh, default is JPEG. Um, I need a PNG because JPEG would, is useless. Um, if he only gives high quality vector design, it's not considered a vector if he only gives a JPEG. Anyway, so let's, let's, let's message this man um, and say... Hey there, 
I am looking for someone to create a design for see design see my english is also shocking design for my print on demand business at the moment i am just testing out a few people this is what i like to say because then he goes the extra mile maybe he'll give me the gig extras for free i'm just testing out a few people to see which one is best for me as i ideally want to order 10 plus shirt shits yeah shirts as i now I, I did want to order lots of shirts because no no dessert. okay i i don't really understand what it is you need me to to give you do you need the niche all right we're gonna see what this guy says and uh i will get back to this video i mean this video is gonna be shot over a few parts because i need him to reply i need to order it and then i need him to actually go and do it and then i need to review it so hopefully this video will be done by tuesday wednesday i don't know when you're watching it but yeah that is the initial process now <sighs> Typically, let's say this video, I knew this video was going to get 20,000 views on YouTube. I would probably um, go and pay for a few more gigs and spend maybe $100, $150 paying for gigs. But because I feel like this video might just get like 30, 40 views, maybe 100 views if I'm lucky, I don't want to spend a whole bunch of money testing out five of people. I'll see how this video does first. Um, I don't want to waste all my money on paying people to create designs for me when I don't need them to create designs for me. But this is just a test to see how people create designs for you on Fiverr. And that way, if you aren't very good at designing, who knows? Fiverr could be your calling. Okay, so the guy has now responded on Fiverr. Let's go through and actually see the messages. It took him quite a while because this is now the next day. But let's just have a look at those messages. Right, so we've got messages over here at the top. I'm not filming this on my camera just because it's easier to... Uh, Film like this. He is offline again, so this is going to be really annoying because he's, he only comes online like in the middle of the night for me. Super annoying. Average response time, eight hours. Right? That is bad. I should have seen that before. Oh, well. Anyway, this was my message to him. He said, hello there. Uh, thank you so much for coming to me. I would love to work with you on this one. You have to let me know the exact text for the designs. And yes, I'll do it. Okay, he needs the exact text. Fine, so... That's really annoying, but on this case, I will guess I'll just do a bit of research, give him the exact text, and then maybe in another video, I'll do a 501 where I pay a bit more money, and I don't have to give him anything, and they do everything for me. But for this time, I'll, I'll give him the exact text. Okay, brilliant. I'm going to order the thing now. I've just come up with the text, so it should be fine. It's a Father's Day t-shirt because I spoke about Father's Day recently. So let's go through and actually order. So here's the page. Let's go through. Click continue. It's actually a bit more. It's it's ten it's ten pound thirteen because of the service fee, but whatever. I'm not gonna click any of this. No, 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 no. No, I'm just gonna do order now. And uh let's have a look at what happens. Okay, let's pay with a credit card. Let me just hide this from the screen. Click confirm and pay. Let's see how this works out, shall we? Just a sec. That's cool advertising right there. That person's lucky. Right, thank you for your purchase. Uh, the send is following information. Kind of the text or any design for the shirt. Okay, so the text I decided to do was this dad has reached level one okay and then father's day 2020 that's what that's what i want him to turn that into some epic design okay the design is on the front the color of the shirt We'll say is black. Oopsie, black. 
Um, how many colors can I use? We'll say you can use three. Three colors and yeah, start the order. Yeah, you see how easy that was. Let's uh, the order is now in the works. We notified designer champ by your order. You should receive delivery by April 29th. I guess that is when the video will be going live. Okay, so we left this off with me ordering a design from Fiverr. So let's have a look if he's actually finished it. Let's go to messages and yes look at that he has delivered the order so let's have a look at this your delivery is here oh righty then okay so here are both your files i've attached printable pngs P printable png is good and necessary because that's what's going to be uploaded onto the platform that we're using to actually go on the t-shirt have a look and let me know if you need any modifications that's nice and kindly write awesome review. Okay, so let's have a look. So the, just to do a slight recap, the wording that I gave him was this. Let's have a look. I don't actually know where I'm gonna find that. Requirements, here we go. This dad has reached level one, Father's Day 2020. That was the wording, all right? So let's have a look at what he's done here. I'm very excited. Um, no, I don't care. Whatever. This dad... Okay. Um, all right. So I'm going to make a few comments on this. Um, the thumbs up is nice, but I just kind of feel like it makes it a bit too cheesy. Um, the level one, I feel, is a bit blurry. I'm not, just, I'm not sure if that's just me. Um, He's got what looks like three fonts, which is good to stick with about three fonts. That's what I say in most of my videos, um, except some fonts are like this and some are like this. And um, he has stuck to the three colors, which is good. To be honest, this dad has reached level one. This is, this is a pretty good design, I'm not gonna lie. For 10 pounds, this is a pretty good design. And the, des the targeting for this design will be fathers who, well, mothers, because the fathers aren't going to buy themselves a t-shirt, but mothers who have been married or in a relationship or whatever, who have kids. The kids have to be between zero and 12 months old. So that way, you know, the dad hasn't yet done a father's day or the chance of them doing a father's day is slimmer. Okay. Because I mean, obviously if the kid is born before, like a couple of months before father's day, there's a chance that the dad has done father's day, but this makes it less likely but all in all that is a really really cool design i'm very happy with that so let's have a look so this is the actual png file like well, you can't really see it can you but um that is a really cool design and that is what you get for 10 pounds and 12 pence on well let's have a zoom in here that is what you get for 10 pounds and 12 pence on Fiverr. Now, I would recommend this guy. Yeah, it took him a bit longer than I would have liked to actually get the design to me, but to be honest, he did a pretty good job. I'm quite happy with this. There's no telling if this is going to work, but I'm quite happy with this. So what you have to factor in is cost now, okay? Cost is going to be really important for you. So if you're spending an average of about 10 pounds or dollars, wherever you're from, on your design, you have to bear in mind that if one in 10 designs succeed on average, right, you're looking at spending a hundred dollars or a hundred pounds just to find the successful design. On top of that, you're also spending between 25 and $50. And this is, doesn't matter where you're from in the world, you should be doing dollars when you're using Facebook ads. If you want to know why, let me know in the comments and I will make a video exactly why, because there's a big reason. But as well as the 10, the 10 pounds or $10 for the t-shirt, you also got the 25 to $50 for designing it. So if you're thinking about it in that sense, if you're doing 10 t-shirts, spending $50 each, that's $500 plus the $100 of all the 10 different designs that you've paid for, that's $600. That means that successful design has to make you at least $600 to break even. That's entirely possible because when you have a successful design on 
uh, on Teespring or Redbubble or Amazon, when you tend to have a successful print-on-demand t-shirt, you just ramp it up with more ads and there's no reason why you shouldn't get more than $600 in sales. Most of my designs that were successful got well over a thousand, well over 2000, just because there's no reason for them to stop getting sales unless the idea dies out and people stop buying and it phases out, which you can tell beforehand. And that keeps you, well, it keeps you in the profit in, in, in the app. Okay. So that is what I pretty much got for buying a design on Fiverr. I hope you like that. I hope you I hope you enjoyed that. Let me know, and I, I, I just thought of this, let me know in the comments down below if you want me to make more of these Fiverr kind of videos, but not necessarily just with design, but with lots of things. So I paid Fiverr to find me targeting, or I paid Fiverr to create a store, I paid Fiverr to find me an Amazon FBA product, or I paid Fiverr to create a promo video, whatever it is, let me know in the comments down below if you want to see more of those things. And yeah, I hope you like this video. Um, please comment, please like, please share. If you haven't already subscribed, definitely hit that subscribe button. I've got some awesome videos coming out and as soon as I hit 10,000 subscribers, I'll be able to start doing stories on YouTube, which I really, really want to do. I'm currently at like eight and a bit thousand and I'm very, very close. So I just want to say thank you very much for watching and I'm looking forward to seeing you in tomorrow's video or the next video that I do, which should be tomorrow.